Hi everyone, this is Diana from Sweet and Savory, and today we're going to be making a highly requested recipe, and that's how to make arepas filled with cheese. Super delicious and really easy to make. I'm going to leave you the link for that recipe in the info box below, but you can also find it at sweetiesalado.com en. To make these arepas, we're going to need pre-cooked cornmeal, the kind that we use to make arepas. We're also going to need shredded mozzarella cheese. We're going to add a little bit of melted butter. We're going to season it with salt. And then to add more flavor, we're going to add milk. I love to use whole milk, but you can use any kind of milk that you want to use. We're also going to add warm water. And then we're going to start mixing all of these ingredients by hand. We're going to knead the dough until it's nice and soft. And if you notice that your dough is a little bit too dry, you can add more water. Or if it's too wet, you can add a little bit more of that pre-cooked cornmeal. Once the dough is ready, we're going to divide it into portions. And then with our hands, we're going to start rolling each portion until we get a small ball. And I would say about the size of a baseball. The next step is to flatten that ball into a small disc and we're going to use the palms of our hands to do this. After that, we're going to make an indent right in the center and then we're going to place our cheese. I love to use string cheese for this and then to make it more cheesy, I add a little bit of mozzarella cheese. You can use either one or you can use both like I'm doing here. Now we're going to close the arepa around the cheese and then we're going to seal the seams with our fingertips. We're going to shape it into a ball once again and then we're going to flatten it with the palms of our hands. And again, if you notice that your dough is a little bit too dry or it has cracks in it, all you have to do is seal them with a little bit of water. To grill the arepas, you can use one of these wired grills that they sell for electric stovetops or the ones that they sell for gas stoves, or you can use a pan. In this video, I'm going to be using a grilling pan because I love the grill marks that you get on the arepas. We're going to heat the pan over medium-low heat. We're going to add a little bit of butter. You can also use oil. And then we're going to grill the arepas for about four to five minutes. And remember, we're not cooking the arepas because we're using pre-cooked cornmeal. We're only grilling them so that we can get that nice color on the outside. And then very carefully, we're going to flip them over so that we can get those grill marks on the other side. And once they're ready, we're just going to let them rest for a few minutes before serving. This is pretty much what the arepas will look like on the outside. And the best part, they're going to be filled with that wonderful mozzarella cheese. And that's your recipe for making delicious Colombian arepas filled with cheese. If you enjoyed this video and this recipe, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and follow me on social media. And to get more delicious recipes, you can go to sweetisalado.com slash en.